moment Like the clock is broken Never stopping, never slowing Yeah, we're living wide open Unwinding every moment Like the clock is broken Never stopping, never slowing Yeah, we're living wide open Just hold it down. Why you hating on the progress? I'm a humble, I don't even pride what I do. I just drive the Maybach through the pride, shit. It's still crazy, I ain't even drive, shit. Hey, from a distance, please don't try me. Cause we'll turn it up on anybody. I see why they don't like me. Yelling out, poor honey, they gon' do heavy. I'm with the posse back at it. That mean, come on, go up, plan them. That mean, I got a kingdom with my mattress. Oh, I got the bitty back bragging. Please, please tell me why you always leave. I'm a human, I'm a human now, but I used to be. I used to be a ranger, a word up. I'm really good at putting words up. I make them levitate and circle with the birds. I don't need to force it, I let it occur. Whatever occurs, thank you. Feel like I was touched by an angel. Once again, a whole never angle. I got a lot of holes in my angle. I got a lot of love and a whole lot of ignorance. And that's a good thing if you want to relate. I'm just trying to relate. I'm just trying to relate. I'm just trying to relate.
Hello, 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 hello,
to the Machiavelli. Left the kids on the belly, left the bit on my celly. She ate the like spaghetti. I'm hitting gas and drinking. Mess the killers in Memphis. Like they from Oakland. Give me my flowers while I can smell them. Ain't talking about roses. Literally, I'm lean. Mix it like a bought it in Nashville. Then I woke up in Tulsa, Oklahoma. It's like California, but nothing like it. I said, I said, I Brandon God and Charles Davis ready for this Madden Ultimate Team matchup as you get a peek at some of the big players in today's game, and you're a big player in today's game as well. Let's get the party started. The kicker Dustin Hopkins set to get this one going. And here we go. We're underway in Madden Ultimate Team. Big mistake here by the kicker, kicking it out of bounds. The one that drives coaches crazy. Keep it in the field of play and let your guys cover. Back to throw now on first down. Throw left side, completion to Rice. 12 yards there as they move the chains. They'll look to throw now on first down. Over the middle, that's caught by Rice. And they're able to get this one down to the 25. A good pick up there, a 22. So after that big play, let's see if they can catch their defense maybe on their heels. Now a play fake here on first down. Backing up. Going for it all. And incomplete. He dropped it in the end zone. Malcolm Mitchell out of the University of Georgia is the intended receiver. And that'll bring up second down. Now here's a timeout called by the Colts on the defensive side of the ball. They'll have two remaining as we step aside here in this first quarter. He'll try again with the arm here on second down. And that one got tipped, kind of threw everything off. It brings up third. Incomplete pass on second down. Let's see what the offense draws up here on third. Well, we're not playing three yards in the cloud dust football anymore. I kind of get why those old school coaches sometimes didn't want to throw the football. Because if this popped up in the air, it almost turns into slow motion. And both sides trying to get to the football, and you're holding your breath wondering whether it's going to go good or bad for your team. They'll go to Bond, try and pound it in. And he fights his way into the end zone for a Redskin touchdown. LeGarrette Blunt taking it in. And the Redskins have taken a first quarter lead. They'll run again with Blunt. And he is not going to make it. They stop him up short. And this will remain a 6-0 ball game. Now after the touchdown, it's Lachlan Edwards to kick it away. This is taken about seven yards deep. Now it's the Chiefs all-time leading rusher. It's Jamal Charles on the carry. A loss of a full three yards, and now it's second down. The evaluation process in today's NFL does not take into account as much bulk as it does speed. And that's what we're seeing with the linebacker position. Those guys that can run, they can play at any spot because they can make plays on the opposite side of the line of scrimmage. A really nice gain of 25 yards. Okay, what can't Deshaun Jackson do? All right, we know about the catches. We just saw another one there. Also gets involved in the return game. And he can break big plays like that. We've seen him do it throughout his NFL career. We have. What are you, are you thinking of anything in particular? Yeah, I'm, I'm still remembering a certain Giants punter <laughs> not following orders. And Deshaun Jackson made that big-time return all the way back for a game winner in that one. I still remember seeing the looks of disbelief on the Giants' sideline. And no escaping this time as he'll go down. They got him for a sack. 
Dante Hightower from his outside linebacker spot, forcing the sack for a loss of eight. They go play action with Wilson. Bringing it in, Jackson left side. And they'll get nine there as that sets him up better for third down. Nine yards to go, it's third down. And defensively, it's a nickel formation here on third down and nine. To throw is Wilson. They'll try and set up the screen. It's complete. And he takes this one in for a Colts touchdown. A great play there from 13 yards out. And the Colts have tied things up. They can take the lead with an extra point. Dustin Hopkins on now to add the extra point. And his kick is right through. Following the touchdown, Dustin Hopkins will kick it away. Yeah. This is fielded a couple yards deep. Uh, and he'll take it back to about the 19-yard line. Come on, I got comes Washington's it. offense as they get set to take over here. Last time they were out, they scored. Still trailing here, though, so some work to do. But it's okay in terms of mindset. Because they scored the last time, they're not quite as worried about being down on the scoreboard because now their confidence is a little bit higher. They feel like they've got something going, and they feel like they can attack again and put more points on the board. Are you scoreboard watching if you're the offense, or are you just focused on this drive? It, it, we wouldn't be telling the truth if we said that they didn't scoreboard watch. Everyone does it to some extent. But you've got to set it aside right now and just focus on this series. That'll take care of the scoreboard if they punch it into the end zone. And second and ten, he'll look to throw again. Oh, he'll want that one back. Incomplete. He doesn't drop too many in that department. Third down. Defense has set themselves up nicely. Third and ten now. From the shotgun, he'll look to throw. And incomplete. The contact made the ball roam free and brings up fourth down. Yeah, he's certainly not a guy that drops that football very often. Indeed, because that's a bit of a surprise. I know he's in the middle of some traffic and people bodies all around him, but he usually has the focus to haul that one in. Tries for Rice, intercepted. Xavier Rhodes with a pick. And they are going to set up shop at the 32-yard line. And now Indianapolis set to take the field. And that last drive, a long drive, but not just that. They had a great air attack going. Do they stick with it? I would think that they would because if they were confident enough to do it on the last drive, starting backed up in their own territory, why would you change anything? They've got to be confident about what they're presenting and continue to do so. Yeah, because the secondary, they really look clueless. And that was amazing because that drive went and went. No adjustments and no big plays by the defense to knock the ball away. They go play action now. Wilson. And this one caught by Des Bryant. And he'll get into the end zone. Touchdown, Indianapolis. Des Bryant, 33 yards. And the Colts add on to their lead. And on that one, able to catch it. Also able to have the wherewithal to take it in for the score. And how about the phases of a successful catch and a completion of the play? Look the ball in, secure the catch, and then, of course, the run after the catch that ends up in the end zone. Following the touchdown, Dustin Hopkins will kick it away. 
This fielded a few yards into the end zone. Oh, look at the juke. And he's able to get it across the 20, but not by much, as he's marked down at the 21-yard line. And here come the Redskins now. And following the interception, just any interception, are you a little bit more cautious when you start that next drive, or no, you just throw that out the window? I think you are. I don't think that there's any way you can run back out there and go, ah, totally didn't affect me. Let's just go ahead and be loose with the football again. You're going to take care of it, but you have to be careful about being too cautious because now you can't run any offense at all. Still yeah. want to attack. We'll see how they attack them here. They come out here in the eye. Again, here's Blunt. Oh, he's got some breathing room. And down he goes, but he takes it up to the 40. Give him 12 yards on that one. It earns him a fresh set of downs. So they pick up the first down after the run, and now they approach for the fresh set. What? Now a shotgun snap I've is a to throw. Over the middle, that's close. I've always had it. I've always had it. And he's taken down, but not before he gets his end to enemy territory yeah, I had it across the, the 40. <laughs> They'll look to throw now on first down. Yeah. Caught on the left side, Fitzgerald. Yeah. And able to break one tackle, but then quickly brought down. But a nice little gain. And now the passing game here in the yeah. second quarter starting to heat up a little bit. Don't you feel the rhythm starting to happen? Right? If you're going to do it, you have to do it for every single person you're going to I think now as a play caller, yeah. because that has happened, you lean on it you a little also bit more. The people you don't go totally uh, away from running the football. Yeah, but you really do good. say, guess what? We can throw it. We can throw it well yeah. with a whole lot of confidence. From the red zone now, they'll look to throw. Throw left side, completion to Rice. A good pick up there, eight yards on the first down completion. They like going to him in the slot, he catches another one. I think this comes under the heading of, until they stop him, why not go back to him? He has something going really well. Great working relationship with the guy throwing the ball, and they keep making the connection. Travis Kelsey, the Pro Bowl tight end, the intended target, and it's third and short. It's a tried and true formula, and I don't think it'll change for as long as we play football. If someone's trying to throw the ball, and you can put pressure up. What? Okay. Like the O'Malley Middle School one. Okay. You know, I gotta see that stuff. A really junior part. No. Only, only the kids in my homeroom. I said everybody in my homeroom. Sorry. You could also do some people from other um, classes too. Could I do Josh? The Fada? Mm. Mom, apparently the person I was talking to um, also might do the Edelman thing. The Edelman thing. What happened with the next one? Yeah. I really don't want to quit this game though because I need one more thing to do. You know what? I'll do it anyway. I was so close to being in the playoffs. Okay, dude, do you want to do like a head to head match? Yeah, I feel that's me. 
Charles and I set for this Madden Ultimate Team matchup as we get a peek at some of the stars in today's game. Well, will they be stars? Will you be a star? We'll find out. Let's play. I am. Dude, she has like her hands folded over her chest. She looks hilarious right now. I have to do the kick with her hands. Set now to kick this one away, and off it goes. To return, here comes Marcus Sherrills. And he's going to go out of bounds. Hey guys, I hope you guys all enjoyed this video, and I'll see you all later. Bye.